So, big win. First of all, I want you to tell me how difficult was it for you coming back after a huge loss against Pana? No, oh, it wasn't difficult at all. You know, after a tough loss, those are the easiest games to play. You're extremely motivated. You're extremely uh, determined to uh, come back and prove, especially, you know, come back from how we played in, in uh, that game to prove that that's not who we are as individuals and that's not who we are as a team. So, um we were excited for this one uh, to, to kind of turn that around and, and, and fix that reputation that we were gaining. You know, after the loss uh, in the basket league, many said, uh, many critics were saying many things about coach, about the team, about the system, about everything. A win, a win like this, is it a statement for you? For you and the whole team, you know? Uh, I don't know if it's a statement. You know, it's a long, uh, a long, long season, you know, and uh, we're at the start of the, of the marathon, you know, still. So, uh, yeah, we have to fix some things and we can't let, uh, you know, uh, we can't let uh, time pass by. But in general, it's a long season. Nobody inside the locker room was uh, worried, but there were things that had to be fixed. Hey, do you have like an extra juice every time you see Faku Kabacho? Because uh, you, you seem like you were extra motivated today playing defense against him. No, and it's not uh, that, but of course he's a top class player. You know, he's uh, he's super fun to play against, um, and I think that we have respect for each other above above all. You know, uh, it's not anything else but respect. And um, you know, when you respect somebody uh, like that, you you want to put your best foot forward always. And uh, I think there's a lot of mutual respect. In it. Many, you know, the fans, the the journalists, everybody around the team were worried after the continuous losses, you know, the straight losses. Mm. Uh, you, inside the team, were you concerned about this at all? I mean, uh, were, you, were you afraid of the continuation or anything? No, we were not afraid uh, because we know what we can do. I think the thing that was concerning was that, uh, you know, it had been a couple of losses in a row and we hadn't changed, you know. We were uh, not uh, coming up with a better... Uh, you know, motivation factor. You know, we were, it was like it was uh, uh, the same energy after a loss, and this is unacceptable. So that's the thing that the only thing that was a bit concerning. Um, but, you know, we fixed it. We had a meeting, we talked about it, we fixed it, and uh, now we move forward. The dunk of Sakma Kisik in the fourth quarter was uh, an extra hype for every one of you. Yeah, of course. It was, uh, uh, it was good to see him fly. You know, it's been a, it's been a minute since we saw him fly like that. Uh, but uh, he played amazing. He's been playing amazing. Great, great form right now. And uh, I have two more things about the, your shots because you were shooting uh, with, uh, you know, huge confidence today. Is this something that comes out from the practice? Because um, many says, the hell? Many one says, you know, about uh, Thomas shooting. Uh, is he a player that uh, should finish the game or anything? What's your perspective on, on those things? Oh, I don't care what anybody says. Uh, I really don't. Uh, I, I go in with my numbers caused. Uh, I have extremely uh, amount of uh, confidence in myself and coach has that confidence in me and that's, uh, that's all that matters to me. And uh, one last thing about uh, Barca. Uh, you faced them uh, last year and you won and you won to the final four. What's your thoughts going to this game? I'll be prepared for another battle, you know, physically and mentally, you know, it'll be... Uh, Another tough game. I believe they're coming off of a win tonight. Uh, so yeah, they'll be uh, they'll be ready to go, and uh, so will we. You're the best brother. Thank you. Thank you.